So it's next morning. Taylor is about to wake up. Here we go, honey. And I don't mind waking her up early because today is going to be a fun day. And then tomorrow is officially her birthday, but we're still going to celebrate like today's her birthday since her parents aren't going to do much for her. First thing first, we're going to get her into the shower so she can clean up. But right after that, we're going to the park. We're not even eating here. Why? Because we're going to eat all types of junk food at the park. She doesn't have a crap ton of money to spare, but the bit that she does have, we're going to spend it on her, okay? This is her last full day being a kid. Her childhood has never been carefree, so today is her chance to finally be a carefree kid. So let's change into our everyday clothes and get to the park. I don't think any bills have come yet. And you know what? I don't care if they did. I just want to go to the park and have fun. And you know what? Anywhere else she wants to go, she can go too. She can do whatever she wants. Because boo, it's your birthday, basically. She's trying to do homework. No, we're not going to do any homework. I'm literally taking the homework out of her pocket. Leaving it in the abandoned trailer. I do not want her worrying about any homework. Come on, let's go to the park. Gonna stay there till it's dark. Where the dogs are nice, even though they bark. This is her story arc as she goes to the park. <laughs> okay, she's finally at the park. Let's see, what's the first thing we want her to do to have some fun? Well... I'll tell you one thing, she's never had her face painted before. It's 50 bucks, we'll sell something to do it. Let's see, she wants to make a snow cone. She wants to do so much fun stuff at the park. We're gonna do it. Let's get her face painted. Let's give her something really cute. What about these? Ooh, let's give her the blue stars, they look cute. Come on, Taylor, go get your blue stars painted onto your face. Hopefully they come out good. If they do not come out good, I'll be so mad because we literally just spent $50. It better be good face paint. And she's getting hungry, so after this, we're going to get her like a snow cone or something, okay? Did it come out good? Oh, she's hungry. But let's see her face. It came out great. She looks awesome with her little stars across her face. Um... Ooh, there's a photo booth. I want her to take pictures in the photo booth. Take a photo. Take normal ones and silly ones. I know it's expensive. But we have money, sort of. We have more money than a kid would have. We can say that at least, right? Yeah. <laughs> snow cones are free, right? I mean, we have money, but, like, snow cones are free, right? Alicia has some pictures that prove that once in her life she was happy. Snow cones are $10? No, let's go get this last photo taken, and then we'll get the snow cone. So what else can we say? We got um, fair tickets. Let's save our fair tickets just in case we can um, get enough money for more fair tickets. She wants to get 20 fair tickets. I don't know about that. But let's go look at the, um, the snow cone booth. Where is it? Where do we get snow cones? Snow cones. Oh, here it is. About to, like, freak out. Like, where are snow cones? I want to... A blue raspberry. I had a blue raspberry slushy the other day for the first time in like two years. And I, I forgot how much I missed them. Had it paired with a, um, a pretzel dog. Oh, so good. Let's get this icy because it will be nicey. Blueberry favor. Ooh, that's spicy. <laughs> that looks good. Dang, I want one now. There we go, having her snow cone. Enjoying a snow cone at the park. I really hope she's enjoying her big day. You know she doesn't have anyone here to hang out with her. Um, I don't even think if she invited him, they could do anything together, unfortunately. But at least she's having fun. She's feeling fulfilled because of the promises. Oh, look, she has blueberry romance going on. Like, you're too young for romance, but I'm glad you're having fun. So there are some flowers over here. Let's pick those up. Because like I said, even though we're having fun, you know, we still have to be mindful that, you know, we are spending money. And the more money we spend, the less money we'll have to move out. Um, let's get more photos taken. A greeting card photo. 
Uh, let's see. What else? I did want to go, um, skating. I don't think she's ever gone skating before. Did she not? She didn't get all the flowers. What's up with that? Why didn't she get all the flowers? She needs all the flowers. You need to come out here and get these flowers, honey. So we got, um, a picture. She's sitting down. Why would she sit down when you're the only one in the picture? It's not like you're making room for anybody else in, to be in the picture, you know? I don't like her parents are here to enjoy the day with her. I mean, technically, she could have invited her parents. All she had to say is, hey, let's all go to the park. But then they might never come back home. Wait, was there another flower that just sprouted? Yes, it did. Hello, Daisy. Daisy, Daisy, give me your answer true. I am broke as shit, so I'm collecting you. After she gets this next flower, I think we're going to work our way around. Because uh, I see there's a flower right next to the water balloon booth. So maybe we can find someone who could play water balloon with her. So maybe there's someone we can play water balloon fight with. These people, whoever you are, just come please and play with us. Oh, they're falling. They're busting their butts. I'm hoping one person will come and play with her. Please, just one person be nice and come play, please. How many tickets does she have? This says she has zero tickets, but I know she has five right here. There's a little raccoon. We're not playing with that raccoon. I'm not trying to get rabies. Is anyone coming to play? I think they're coming, but they're on the skate, so they're coming slowly. And we just lost five bucks, probably because of what the parents are doing at home. She's coming to play. Thank you, Courtney. Um, Is anyone else coming? At least the team will be even. So can we start playing together and the rest of the people can, like, join later or something? At least she's playing. Oh, careful, Taylor. Oh, right in the gut. Sorry, honey. At least she's having fun. It looks like she's getting a hidden skill for this, too. Maybe that's athletic. I don't know. So it looks like he's coming to join us. Is he on our side or her side? Okay, she got some help now. All right. Is anyone else coming to play with us? It would be nice if someone did. I don't see anyone else coming, though. Oh, right in her face. Yes. I like this. Get her again. Aw, mister. Taylor looks like she's having an absolute blast right now. Yeah, there we go. Oh, my gosh. Is that her friend over there? I think that's him. I think that's her little friend. Yes, it is. Yes, that's him. Hey, Robbie. <gasps> her and Robbie can get pictures together, right? Take photo, normal pose. Take take silly photos with Robbie. Yes. Abandon these losers. Her friend is here. See, that's how you know. He's such a good friend. He showed up for her, like, unofficial birthday party before the birthday party. That was so sweet of him to come. Come on, get in here with me. Robbie, come on. You didn't get in, Robbie. Okay, he's coming. Good. She's hungry again? Really? That snow cone wore off that quick? Dang. I thought we were good. We're going to have to get, like, real food or something. I mean, he's our friend, so we'll treat him, of course. Um, but let's play some shootout before we eat. Here we go. Shoot out. She really wants to have a pillow fight with him, but I don't think she can have it. Um, at least we can try and play shootout together. Oh, he better be nervous, because I bet she's pretty good at this. Oh, she's so hungry. But let's play for a little bit, though. Yeah, come on. Let's see what you got, Taylor. Oh, he sucks. Go, Taylor. Go, Taylor. It's your birthday. Unofficially, it's your birthday. We're gonna party unofficially like it's your birthday. <laughs> I'm just glad she's having so much fun right now. I know she's hungry, though. I know we will rectify that problem soon. Um, there's a pit in the basket over here. Somebody left a hamburger and a hot dog. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna grab a plate. And Fab, we're not gonna do that. We're gonna get real food. Like, yeah, she never gets real food, and we're gonna get, like, real food. See, we're gonna buy food from the booth. 
We're gonna pretend like we're not poor today. Okay, now it's her time to try and catch that ball. Come on. You can do it, Taylor. Don't worry. You got this, honey. Come on. Aw, Taylor. You're dodging to the left. You're dodging to the right. You need to be going to the left, honey. No, 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 honey. Like, not your left. My left. Well, she's gonna... Wait, where's she going? Yeah, she's gonna go buy food now. Um... Hopefully he sticks around because I would like them to do other stuff together. Like, I, I guess they could go skating together, right? No, she can't get him to go skating with her. Aw, can they play golf together? No. They could probably have a water balloon fight together. Okay, let's get some food. Hopefully nothing's too expensive. French fries is $8. Chili cheese fries is 10 A hamburger. I want her to have some food that she wouldn't normally get. Especially at home, pulled pork sandwich sounds so good. Oh my gosh, let's get that. They have funnel cake. I love funnel cake. But this pulled pork, I mean, she's hungry. You know, she need real food. Like I said, I hope her little friend sticks around. If he want to come eat a hot dog over here, he can. I don't know where he's at, though. And I don't even see him. Um, Definitely want her to go skate, though, after she eats the sandwich. It's already like four o'clock. Wow. Um, can she get like a photo in here with him? A greeting card photo with him? Greeting card with Robbie. There we go. He's actually coming over here. She finished her sandwich. They can get into the booth together. Look where he, look, he's right there when she needs him. Oh, they're kind of matching because they're still in their gym clothes. That's cute. Yay, her and her best friend, her BFF. They end this together. That's so lovely. What it say? Is it three for happy, two for people, none for crying people? That's sad. Her picture is her sitting on the ground again, but whatever. Um, what else can they do together? Cause they can't skate together because she can't make him skate. Oh, they have like the little game she wants to play. They could probably play that together. Where is he on the list? Here he is. She'll pay for it, of course. But that's just the nature of, like, being in control of the sim. They pay for everything anyway. You know, not like she has the money for it, but at least she can have some fun. Another hot dog eating contest going on today. But she's been so excited to play this game, so I can't wait for her to actually play it. So, which seat is he taking? He's taking that one? I just realized they have, like, the old, I'm about to say old-fashioned. I, I think arcade still have these, the red button that'd be, like, a quarter here, 50 cent here, a dollar here. And when they mess up, your coins come back here, and then they take the coins from there. Anyway, let's see. They're playing a game. Oh, it's, like, tanks? Okay, it's tanks game. And she wants to uh, play catch with him. I don't know if we can play catch. I don't think we have a ball on us or anything, and I'm not buying a ball. She spent too much money at this fair already. She still got to buy a $30 birthday cake for herself in the morning. Did she win? I hope she won. I know she got points just for playing, but I hope she won. Maybe the game's not over yet. I'll tell you one thing. She can't play round two because she ain't got enough money for that. Can she play skee ball with him? No. Uh, I am going to let her go skate. Even if he can't do it with her. Then at least she can do it and she can have some fun. I do see that there are more flowers around here, though. Maybe I'll go pick these up first. It's already starting to get dark, though, unfortunately. But she's having so much fun. I don't want to send her home yet. And I don't care who's calling. We're not picking up. Oh. What do we need to get, though? Oh, there's a lot of things we need to get. We're not, no, we're not doing all that. That's too much. Far too much. Oh, it's starting to get cold in the park, but she still wants to go skating, so we're going to do it. Okay, her dad's no longer a night owl or excitable. He's now a vegetarian and a heavy sleeper. So he's an evil vegetarian? I might believe that. <laughs> Obviously, not all vegetarians or vegans or mean people. But there are a few that are. Not going to name names. But you know them probably. 
Um, let's, uh, let's see. I know there's more flowers around here. Let's just uh, let her collect one more. Cause that's really the only other one I see. And then let's get her back on here. And then let's get her back over here so she can go skating. Robbie's still here. I really wish that when she gets on there, she can be like, join me for a quick skate, you know? But I don't know if I can do that. I don't know if he'll do it if she is able to ask him. I just really want her... To have a little bit more fun before she has to go back home because she's tired. She needs to um, go to the bathroom. Oh, he's eating. Okay, you know what? He should eat because if you get too hungry, he might leave. He might die. That would ruin her birthday if her best friend died. Ask to join skating. He ate enough. Yeah, you ate enough. You ate enough. You look like you had at least five bites of that hot dog or hamburger or whatever it was. So he should definitely come skate with her. She's having such a great day, and it's even more special because she gets to do it with her best friend. Spin with Robbie. Spin with him. It'd be so sweet. Oh, my gosh. Are they actually going to do this? She's waiting for him in the middle. Come here, Robbie. We're going to spin together. Robbie. Oh, my gosh. They're actually going to spin together. That's so cute. Yeah, look at her. Aw. Look at them being so careful with each other, too. That's so cute. Oh, no. You okay? You got it? No, no, they don't. Ooh. Aw. That's okay. They did good, right? Can we spin again? Yes, let's try that again, please. Yep, there we go. Mm-hmm. You got it this time, guys. Oh, that was so cute. Oh, she's leaving because she has to go to the bathroom. Well, we're not going to let her go to the bathroom here. We're going to send her home. Actually, I think that the fair is ending in, like, less than an hour. So, I think everyone's going to get ready to go anyway. So, I'm just going to have her go home now then. She ate enough, I think. You know? So, it's time to go home then. But I'm glad she had so much fun. I'm glad that Robbie came. And hung out with her. Of course, she'll invite him over tomorrow for her not official birthday party. Wait, can kids throw birthday parties? Would she be allowed to have a birthday party? I mean, she can invite him over and then have a cake, but will it be considered a party? Because now I don't know. Either way, I'm totally ready to send her home. Oh, she never got to redeem her tickets. No, wait. We got to redeem these tickets. That's the best part of the fair, redeeming tickets. Come on, the booth's right here. We have nine minutes. You don't have time to yawn. Come on, we got to re redeem these things. Come on. Three seconds. Come on. One second. Okay, I think she got there in time to redeem it, though. Come on, please let her redeem her tickets. Be nice. Okay, she can get something. Okay. So, she has enough to buy a few things. She has 15. Um, I think we can only buy one thing at a time, though. Or can we buy multiple? No, we can only buy one thing. The inflatable raft thing is cute, and I think we can get some money back for it. So, let's purchase that. Oh, we, we can buy more. Okay, let's buy the um holiday cannon. And now she used up all her tickets. So, let's send her on home now. She wants to warm up. Yes, let's get her to that abandoned trailer park so she can warm up. Ooh, but there's a flower right here. We're going to grab that really quick and then send her home. There's her friend. He's running home, too. Uh, I wish I knew where he lives. I kind of want to follow him. But then that's creepy, isn't it? I think it would be. But anyway, I think she had a great time today to celebrate her unofficial birthday. When she gets home, she's going to have to wash up. She's like, yeah, she and she needs to go to the bathroom so bad. Um, Today went way better than I thought it was going to go. Like, I didn't expect him to show up there. You know, I didn't expect them to be able to do so much with each other and interact and whatnot. Oh, there's another flower and I want it, but nope, we got to get her back to the trailer. I'm just very pleasantly surprised. Um, I feel bad that she has to go back home to her parents in the trailer, but at least she was able to escape. She was finally able to be a kid for once. And her dad's actually cooking. This is a first. Um, she, 
Oh, the bathroom's broken now. Great. Gotta go to the other outhouse. But look, her dad actually cooked. Didn't know he could do that. I'll actually grab a plate and eat with dad after she gets out of the bathroom, of course, because she really has to go. Gross outhouse. But at least she can get all clean up in there. How you get clean in the outhouse? I don't even want to think about it. Because the outhouse is just a hole in the floor. That's all the outhouse is. Okay? But the point is, she's all cleaned up. She's going to have a hot dog with her daddy. Oh, apparently she's not going to have a hot dog with her daddy. Because he is um not going to eat with her. But I'm going to let her eat this hot dog. And then we're going to put up the food so it doesn't go bad. In fact, I'll put it up right now. We're going to put her back into her trailer and let her go to sleep. Her mama done woke up now. And her, her mom wakes up and immediately is like, I'm going to go play on the swing. Like, she didn't ask, is anybody hungry? Did anybody cook? Baby, where have you been all day? Are you enjoying your birthday weekend? Like, nope. She's just like, I just want to swing. I'm just going to swing my little old heart out. That's all she's thinking about. Anyway, Taylor was finally able to eat. I'm going to put down her sleeping bag and tell her to go get on in it. So glad. Don't worry about dishes, honey. Leave it right there on the floor. Right there. Uh-huh. Yep, someone will clean it. And if they don't, they don't then. But tomorrow's the big day. Tomorrow, we're going to get her cake and throw her a birthday party. Uh, it may not be an official birthday party. No, she can't have an official birthday party. Yay! We're going to plan that pretty much as soon as we can then for tomorrow morning. But right now, she just needs to go to bed and get some sleep. And in a couple of hours, she'll be a teenager. And then she can tell her parents to kiss her ass and she'll be out of here. Anyway, happy birthday, Taylor. I'm glad that her parents are at least, you know, here celebrating with her. I mean, don't they say when boys pick on you, it's because they like you? Maybe that's what he was doing? I mean, he didn't go about it the right way, but at least he's being nice. Is her mom really trying to ruin this moment for her? Ew, and she sneezed on her. 